Guys, so we're heading back to our office in Game Dev Tycoon, so welcome. Make sure to hit that bell notification down below to never miss a video from me and stuff like that. Subscribe and like this video, and let's go ahead and get started in Game Dev Life. And uh, so you do have to pay 150 Robux to access this game, uh, but it's if you really want to like test it and take it into consideration and stuff, it is a really cool game, so I am enjoying it so far. But I recommend just waiting for it later so the price does get lowered down, or even when it comes out, which it'll be free. But with all things, you do have to wait and possibly it won't even finish. But that's that all depends. But I'm pretty I'm pretty confident in this dev team. Alright, let's go ahead and get on this computer and start a new game. Um, we're still level one. Uh, so let's do an action because we haven't done that one yet. I had a lag spike with it. That was weird. Uh, action racing. Let's do that. Cool. Alright. Example crazy cars. Yeah, let's do the example. Crazy cars. <laughs> Alright. Yes. Okay. Uh, PC market share 36% boom uh, I can't do any of this price $15 let's do that all right because what's the most important in your game so we got racing uh, I think everything should be balanced in racing probably all right finish phase one development okay racing games usually don't have a story AI is pretty important in racing games but gameplay above all at least in my opinion that's what I see in most racing games at least Phase 2 development. Alright. So we got Aiden over here. I'm not sure how to bring his happiness up. I'm, oh, 40. Oh. Mm. Last time I checked, too, it was in the 40s. So I think he's doing a little bit better. We probably want to get some new stuff in the office and make sure his happiness is good. So we can unlock a server for 5,000 cash. Mm. We should probably get that, actually. Character design. I uh, don't really need that. Dialogue. Art slash UI. And a racing game, none of this is really needed too much. I'm not really sure, but we'll go with that for now. We're almost finished, guys. Countdown. All right. Oh, it goes past. Uh, whoa. John Rush has topic combination 100%. Whoa. We got a really high score for that. Really good score. Best game I've ever seen. So fun. Wow. Best game I've ever seen. 37 out of 40. Holy cow. We did good. Awesome. All right. Let's go ahead and unlock. Not lo Oh. We're not level two. Okay. Okay. So we can. I can't really train him at all. I'm not really sure how. Upgrade for 16,000. Higher sell move. Okay. Um, shop. Let's see what else we got here. Drinks machine. Oh, that's really expensive. Uh, decorations. I'm not really sure if decorations help with anything. I'm not really sure. Long wall. Entertainment. It's food and drink. We got drinks machine. Furniture and setups. We got a standard PC setup. For 5,000 cash. I guess we can get a new worker for that. What do workers help with anyways? Because, like, I know I know you're supposed to hire them and and they help with stuff. But what do they ex actually help with? Because I'm not exactly 100% sure. So, we'll get a new PC and see to cancel. Uh, let's hire somebody. Hire uh, zero cash a month. More unlocked when you level up. Okay. Let's put Ethan there. There we go. Welcome, Ethan, to the game. All right, so he should be uh, helping us out, I would believe so. Okay, let's go here. Okay, so now we need to go to the factory like usual and get like a drop off. I don't think that's my car. This is probably my car. Okay, let's go. Whee! <laughs> Who's this dude? What the? Who is that guy? <laughs> is this the random guy standing in the middle of the road? All right, that's cool. Turn left. I'm, I, I'm kidding, guys. That means right. That totally means right. I was messing with you guys. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta love like the old days, the, like when GPSs were first a thing. Cause oh man, they were terrible. But now GPSs are pretty good. But even still, mine is like on my like Google Maps on my phone. Like if especially in cities, sometimes it will, uh, it won't even uh, keep up and stuff. And sometimes it gets a little confusing. All right, let's go ahead and uh, get this box. Whoa, what did you do to your car, sir? I think we have a problem here, Houston. We have a problem. We got a car that's stuck in a conveyor. Okay, let's, uh, I don't think I can help this guy, so let's go ahead and take my crate over to the shop and sell our games to the mall. I'm surprised it's the mall. That would be, I mean, you could sell games at a mall, but, like, out of anything else, a mall. Should have, like, a, uh, some other stores here, too. That would be cool. All right. We got 25 Blitz Bucks. I'm pretty sure, ah! I, I keep thinking the entrance is right there for some reason, but the entrance is right here. Oh, well. Still a pretty easy way to go. You gotta you gotta hold down shift to get the places, man. It helps a lot. All right, drop it, drop the base. 
Sell game stakes, I'll put them on sale. Release game. Boom. Alright. So let's go ahead and uh get back in me car. Alright. Sell right out of the way. So let's see if our XP and fans and our money start to grow. Oh, we got more fans. Got some money too. View game analytics. Crazy cars. Oh, we've made a lot of profit so far. Dang. The game's doing amazingly. So that's what happens when you get good ratings and stuff. Current game stats. Okay. That guy's car is still really, really stuck. <laughs> I feel pretty bad for him. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, grab another crate because we need one more drop off. Ew. Whoa. Did you guys just hear that? What was that noise? What was that noise? Ha. Huh. Too bad there's two entrances, bro. He's trying to block me off, but he can't. Ugh. Now I'm stuck on the gate for some reason. He doesn't know that there's two entrances. He's trying to block me off, but he can't. All right, let's go over here. <laughs> he knew he messed up that day. Holy cow, we made some serious money on this game. 17 grand so far? Well, that's more like 12. But it's still going. That's what happens when you get a good rating. Holy cow. 600 sales, 12,000 profit, number of staff too. Holy cow. Oh, we need another drop off. It's still selling. Oh, man. This game must be selling really good. All right. Let's go ahead and head back down to the factory again. Oh, uh, we probably should have gone the other way, but we can go ahead and cut through here. It doesn't really matter too much. I just hope not to fall into... Oh, that was close. Hope not to fall into that uh, river or something. That'd be pretty bad. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, turn. Oh, yes. All right. Boom. Oh, jeez. <laughs> That's a really aggressive Ford Fusion. Holy cow. And it's not, it's supposed to be a replica, but it, it's honestly, like, almost exactly. Okay. 15,000 profit. 15 for the price and 721 sales. That was a good success for us. A very good success. So depending on the genre and stuff, the way you do uh, your stats on, like, the story and stuff like that on the game will greatly impact how the game, like, rates and does and stuff. It, it's, it's surprising. I did play a very similar tycoon to this that's not on Roblox. Um, this is kind of like a replica of it, except it's way different. It has its own twist, but um, we'll see how that happens. All right, we got one more drop off. Go ahead and drop off that. Sell games. Put them on sale. Congratulations, you've delivered all the copies, so now you can make another game. Cool. We had to do three deliveries for that. That's actually a lot. We gained so many more fans. And I, I okay, I believe how this works is that as you grow more fans, you'll sell more and more copies of the game next time. I believe that's how that works. So, we're almost level 2. I can't wait to get to level 2 because we can buy a server room, which would be very useful. We're making some progress, guys. I mean, we got $20,000, too. I mean, we're doing great. Alright. Let's go ahead and actually park in the garage this time. <laughs> Alright. Alright, let's go ahead and head back here. Vehicles are so expensive. I'm not sure they're I'm pretty sure they're not too expensive once you do, uh, like, make some good money on this game. So, uh, upgrade for 90000 Yeah, right. <laughs> Train. This guy's... Their happiness is so low. I'm not really sure how to get it up. Premium laptop setup. Standard PC setup. Monitor PC. Premium PC. I got the triple monitor. Alright. Glass wall. Holy cow. It's expensive. Um, office light. I, I'm... I... I'm pretty sure that decorations do close to nothing on this game, but that's just my assumption. So entertainment, food and drink definitely does increase your happiness for your workers. All right, well, there's that. There's a lot of stuff you can get on this game. We're ready to start a new project. Okay, we're gonna do this. Not enabled. Oh, okay. <laughs> all right. Um, we've done all three of these. We'll try another tycoon again. Okay, so let's do another racing tycoon because that sounds cool. Uh, car mechanic, uh, tycoon. Cool. Okay. It <laughs> reminds me of Roblox. All right. Uh, man, you're going to lock these new market shares, but PC is the best so far. But I'm sure the market share changes up uh, as you go along. Look at all these consoles they have. Holy cow. I think you could do multiple platforms, but I'm not really sure. Okay. Let's do that. Finished. Okay, 15 bucks. We'll do 10 bucks. This, we'll, we'll do 12. All right, let's do that. So we're doing Racing Tycoon. So sounds definitely not that important. Graphics, yeah. And then this probably be more important too. Okay, so story. 
<laughs> you don't really need a story to Tycoon AI. Not really needed either. Gameplay is going to go up there. Okay, so character design, not really important. Dialogue, eh, a little bit in the Tycoon, and then art and UI. Um, I'd say that's a little bit more important in a Tycoon. All right, phase three development. Let's wait and see what happens. Um, and then after this episode, I'll probably take a break and play something else. I'm not really sure yet. I might return to Boardwalk Tycoon. That seems, that seems a lot of fun. All right. I've been playing a lot of Black Desert Online recently. That game is aw it's an awesome MMORPG. Whoa. Oh, no. Whew. John lost us topic combination, 15%. Ooh. I don't know. That score seems a little bad. I don't know what I did wrong. Not the best. All right. Not too bad. Really addictive. Hey, Roblox rated the game. Okay. There's a lot of references. Okay, so now we need to go get our drop-offs and I'll do that. So, basically how this Tycoon works, or Game Dev Life. Well, it is it is a Tycoon pretty much, but... Um, so, you, you have a car. You make your games out of all these sliders and settings. Dude, can you not? <laughs> Jeez, man. Get, off, get, a, get away from my car. How's he following me so well? That's weird. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna reverse out of the way and try to get away from this dude. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's uh. Jeez, is he like hooked up to my car or something? What the heck? Oh man, this is not fun. Let's respawn our car. It it would be nice in this game if you could uh just clip through players instead of being blocked by them because it is pretty annoying. All right, let's go ahead and head to, over to that factory. All right, let's go ahead and get our crate. They, they come out super slow. It'd be so cool if you could see the production going on in the factory, but unfortunately you can't. But still, that's a really cool design for a factory. I like it. All right. So we'll see how many crates we need for this one. Th I'm afraid this game might not do that well, but we do have a nice boost of fans right here, so that's definitely going to help us out. I can't imagine what's going to happen in the future of this game because, like, or when you get really far into it, because, like, we already made, like, $20,000. Imagine, uh, what if you get really big? I, <laughs> I don't I don't know how many people are really that big on this game, but holy cow. And I'm not really sure how much content there is after alpha, but we'll see. Sell games. Thanks. I'll put them on sale. Release game. Cool. I kind of didn't put it on the exact spot. Okay, so we need another drop off. Go over here. Do that all over again. I don't, I don't think you can carry multiple crates. Maybe you can with the better cars, but I don't, I don't think you can. But we'll see. I do hope, too, that the different cars do sound different, because this, I don't know why, but this car is really annoying. All right, I'm going to pick that up. I mean, it sounds fine when it's idling, but once you get it up to the high uh, speed, I mean, it just, it just sounds like a really like bad electric motor or something. <laughs> this guy's running around. Hey, man. <laughs> he's like, hello. I think he's going to pick up his crates. All right, so we're going to head back to the mall once again. Oh, guys, I don't think you noticed. But we're almost level two. That's awesome. Sweet. All right. Going to drop this off. We're making some more fans, by the way. Not that many, though. We're making a pretty okay money. Yeah, this game definitely kind of flunked, but it's it's going all right. Game go, goes off sale in 11 weeks, so it kind of counts down manually, it looks like. Weeks go by fast in this game, so we need to get another drop off. I hope when the... Ooh, that was a bad collision. So, um... I hope in the future in this game, hopefully we don't have to collect a lot of crates, because that would be kind of annoying. Um, I know this is only the small crates, but there's also medium and large crates, so we'll see what happens with that, too. Alright, our game officially went off sale, and we still have pending orders. So, yeah, that that did extreme. That, that game flunked, but we still made 5k. Didn't really make any fans at all, but we did get a lot of XP, so... I mean, it, it wasn't really that worth it. I still wish we did as well as the other game, but... Oh, well. Alright, let's go ahead and head back. Alright, this is our last crate. It's not going to make us any money, but it'll at least get our other orders done with. Okay, sell games. This game has a lot of, like, really cool systems in it. Okay, let's go ahead and head back. I think this is our car. Nope, that's definitely not it. If, if you walk through the car and it d nothing happens, then it's probably not your car. Whoa, we just kind of almost tipped that over. Here we go! <laughs> It'd be funny if this game had nitrous. Please don't add nitrous. <laughs> Alright, let's head back. Yeah, guys, so I think we're going to end the episode of Game Dev Life, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. Pretty awesome game. I did enjoy it, so I think next episode after this, we're going to level up. We're going to get probably maybe the quad digits for fans. Going to get some more money. And I think that's our next goal. And probably get the server room, too. I mean, it's not that much to unlock. It's only 5,000 cash. Hopefully, the server room makes things more interesting. But, yeah, that's all there is to Game Dev Life. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Make sure to big a...
Make sure to leave a big fat thumbs up. And I'll see you guys later. And that's all. Thank you to the fans who recommended this series to me. And I'll see you later. Thanks for watching.